Hey everyone, it's your name, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're diving into the wonderful world of hair care. I'm excited to share my tips and tricks for achieving long, silky, smooth hair. Now, I know what you might be thinking. Genetics play a huge role, and you're absolutely right. But even if you weren't blessed with naturally perfect hair, don't worry. The right kind of care and products can make a world of difference. Trust me, I've experimented a lot with my hair over the years, and I've learned so much along the way. So, if you're ready to embark on a hair care journey with me, grab a cuppa, get comfy, and let's get started. Let's kick things off with the foundation of healthy hair, what you eat. Just like our bodies need the right nutrients to thrive, so does our hair. Protein strengthens the hair shaft and promotes growth. Ensure you're getting enough lean meats, fish, eggs, or plant-based proteins. Vitamins and minerals are essential for hair growth. Iron carries oxygen to hair follicles. Stock up on leafy greens and spinach. Vitamin C helps with collagen production, keeping hair strong and elastic. Stay hydrated. Water prevents dryness and breakage. Drink plenty of water throughout the day. Remember, a healthy diet equals healthy hair. Now, let's talk about hair washing. It seems simple enough, right? But trust me, there's a bit of an art to it. First things first, how often should you wash your hair? It really depends on your hair type and how oily it gets. If you have dry hair, you can probably get away with washing it every other day or even less. But if you have oily hair, you might need to wash it every day or every other day. Just listen to your hair and do what feels right for you. The key here is to choose a shampoo that's gentle and sulfate-free. Sulfates can be quite harsh on your hair, stripping away its natural oils and leaving it feeling dry and brittle. Look for shampoos with natural ingredients and avoid anything that makes your scalp feel tight or itchy. And don't forget about conditioner. Apply conditioner from the mid-lengths to the ends of your hair, where it needs the most moisture. And here's a little trick I learned. Try a cold water rinse after conditioning. It helps to seal the hair cuticles and add shine. Navigating the world of hair products can feel like a maze, but fear not, I'm here to guide you through it. The first step is to identify your hair type. Is it dry, oily, curly, straight, fine, thick? Once you know your hair type, you can start looking for products specifically designed for your hair needs. One of my holy grail products is a good leave-in conditioner. It's like a tall drink of water for your hair, providing continuous moisture throughout the day. I like to apply it to damp hair after showering, focusing on the ends. Trust me, it makes a world of difference. Hair serums are another game changer. They're like little miracle workers that smooth down flyaways, add shine, and protect your hair from heat styling. Look for serums with ingredients like argan oil or jojoba oil, which are super nourishing for your hair. And if your hair is feeling a little extra dry or damaged, a weekly hair mask can work wonders. Apply a generous amount to damp hair, leave it on for 15 to 20 minutes, and then rinse it out. Okay, so we've washed and conditioned our hair, and now it's time to dry it. But before you reach for the hair dryer, let's talk about towel drying because, believe it or not, how you towel dry your hair can make a big difference. The key is to be gentle. Vigorously rubbing your hair with a towel can cause friction and breakage. Instead, gently squeeze out excess water with a soft, absorbent towel. Now, if you have time, air drying is always the best option for your hair. It's the most natural and least damaging way to dry your hair. But if you're short on time, a hair dryer is totally fine. Just make sure to use it on a low heat setting and keep it moving. And here's a little tip. Try using a heat protectant spray before blow drying. It acts like a shield protecting your hair from heat damage. Let's talk about heat styling. Who doesn't love a good curling iron or straightener to create those fabulous hairstyles, right? But we have to be careful because excessive heat styling can really take a toll on our hair. When we apply heat to our hair, it's like we're cooking it. And just like overcooking our favorite dish can dry it out, the same goes for our hair. So the golden rule here is to use heat styling tools sparingly. Try to limit your use to special occasions or a couple of times a week at most. And when you do use heat, Always use a heat protectant spray beforehand. It's like giving your hair a suit of armor against those high temperatures. Another tip is to lower the heat setting on your styling tools. You might be surprised at how effectively you can style your hair, even with a lower temperature. Embrace your natural hair texture whenever you can. 
I know, I know, hearing the word trim can send shivers down your spine, especially when you're trying to grow your hair long. But trust me on this one, regular trims are your secret weapon for achieving those long, silky, smooth locks you've always dreamed of. When you trim your hair, you're essentially getting rid of any dry, damaged split ends that are making your hair look dull, frizzy, and unhealthy. Those split ends, if left unattended, can travel up the hair shaft, causing even more damage and breakage. By getting a trim every six to eight weeks, you're preventing those split ends from wreaking havoc and allowing your hair to grow out healthier and stronger. Now, I know it can be scary to chop off any length, especially if you're trying to grow your hair out, but honestly, a little trim goes a long way. Plus, it makes your hair look so much thicker and healthier. It's like a breath of fresh air for your hair. So, book that appointment with your stylist and don't be afraid to say goodbye to those split ends. Your hair will thank you for it. Let's talk about hair care routines. Just like we have a skincare routine, it's important to have a consistent hair care routine that nourishes and protects our precious locks. And the best part? It doesn't have to be complicated. First things first, let's talk about brushing. Brushing your hair regularly helps to distribute the natural oils from your scalp down to the ends, keeping it moisturized and healthy. But just like with everything else, be gentle. Avoid brushing your hair when it's wet, as that's when it's at its most fragile. Instead, use a wide-toothed comb or a detangling brush to gently work through any knots or tangles. And speaking of scalps, don't forget to give your scalp some love. A healthy scalp is essential for healthy hair growth. You can give yourself a little scalp massage while you're shampooing or conditioning. It feels amazing and helps to stimulate blood flow to the hair follicles, promoting hair growth. Oh, and here's a bonus tip. Try switching to a silk or satin pillowcase. We've talked a lot about how to care for our hair from the inside out, but what about protecting it from external aggressors? Just like our skin, our hair is exposed to various elements that can cause damage. Let's start with the sun. Too much exposure to those UV rays can dry out our hair, fade our hair color, and even lead to breakage. So next time you're heading out for a day in the sun, be sure to protect your hair just like you would your skin. Wear a hat, use a hair product with UV protection, or seek shade whenever possible. Another culprit that can wreak havoc on our hair? Chlorine. Swimming pools are so inviting, but that chlorine can strip away your hair's natural oils. To minimize the damage, try rinsing your hair with fresh water before and after swimming. You can also apply a leave-in conditioner or hair oil to create a protective barrier. Let's talk about natural remedies for hair care. Mother Nature has provided us with so many incredible ingredients that can work wonders for our hair. And the best part? They're gentle, effective, and good for both our hair and the environment. One of my all-time favorite natural hair care ingredients is coconut oil. It's like a miracle worker. Coconut oil is a natural moisturizer that can penetrate the hair shaft, nourishing it from the inside out. You can use it as a pre-shampoo treatment, a hair mask, or even a leave-in conditioner. Simply warm up a small amount in your hands, apply it to your hair, and leave it on for at least 30 minutes before washing it out. Another ingredient that deserves a spot in your hair care routine is aloe vera. Aloe vera is known for its soothing and healing properties. It can help to soothe an itchy scalp, reduce dandruff, and promote hair growth. You can apply fresh aloe vera gel directly to your scalp, or look for hair products that contain aloe vera as an ingredient. And let's not forget about the power of a good old-fashioned egg mask. We've talked a lot about achieving long, silky, smooth hair, but what about the things we should avoid? Just like there are good habits, there are also bad habits that can sabotage our hair goals. Tight hairstyles can stress your hair follicles, leading to breakage. Alternate between different styles and opt for loose ones. Overprocessing with chemicals can strip your hair's natural oils, leaving it dry and damaged. If you must, do it sparingly and go to a professional. Avoid hot water when washing your hair. Use lukewarm water and finish with a cool rinse to seal cuticles and add shine. And there you have it, our ultimate guide to achieving long, silky, and smooth hair. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Achieving the hair of our dreams doesn't happen overnight. It requires a holistic approach, a sprinkle of patience, and a whole lot of self-love. Remember, healthy hair starts from within, so nourish your body with a balanced diet, stay hydrated, and treat your hair with the same care and attention you give to your skin. Be kind to your hair, 
avoid harsh treatments, and embrace those natural textures whenever you can. Thank you so much for watching, and I can't wait to see all your gorgeous, silky, smooth hair transformations.